ever wondered what to do with your brine once you're finished using it for whatever meat that you use the brine for? Well, I am going to show you what I do with the brine that I use for my beef steak and also the seasoning that I use for my salmon that I fill in. So stay tuned and let's get into how I use my brine from my beef steak and all of the seasoning and all that goodiness from the um, salmon that I fill in. Let's get in the kitchen. Let's get started. Before I continue, I want to show you. This is the brine. The link would be above. And this is the fish. This is all what is inside of this bowl. All this goody goodness. I am now going to place it into that brine water that we had from the beef, beef steak. That recipe, as I said, will be above. So I let this simmer on a low heat for one hour. It's simmer there, cooking and taking in all that goodness from the brine. So now that the broth has cooled, I'm going to use my jar, a funnel, and a measuring cup. I'm going to fill, to fill this up. And I'm going to use this to cook rice. I am going to use it to cook beans. And if I'm going to make a stew, I could use this instead of plain water. There's so much things you can use a broth or a stock for to bring flavor to your dish or sauce, whatever you're making. It really enhance your meal and how did we make this we use the brine from the beef that we made and also the seasoning from the fish that we previously seasoned we use all of that seasoning plus because remember we fillet that salmon so we use that bowl along with the brine from the beef and we made that so we didn't add any extra salt, nothing, nothing, because the brine was full of flavor and the um, salmon had tons of seasoning and, and, and flavor. So we didn't need to add nothing to that. So now let's funnel that liquid into, into this container. So now it's full and we're going to cover and place in the refrigerator. I don't use this for more than two weeks after two weeks, but most times I don't, it don't last that long because I would use it out. But um, <clears throat> this has no type of preservatives or anything in it. So I would only suggest that you go no longer than two weeks with this in the refrigerator unless you're freezing it and defrosting and using it then you can use it of course but once you're leaving it just like this and placing it in your refrigerator i say between one to two weeks use this up all right then guys thanks for watching and recipe bye and don't forget right now on your screen you're seeing the link for the brine and for the fish that we use the seasoning for to make this. Don't forget to check it out right now.